on the next American War Stories. Battleground. Iraq. Robert Kelly deploys and within an instant realizes no man can prepare for war. We thought we were going to starve, so we like brought like little like uh, bars and stuff. Like, well, there's going to be no food. There was more. F I gained 30 pounds in Iraq. There was. You go to the buffet. There's Chinese food, mac and cheese, barbecue, pizza, ice cream. You can walk up to uh, this ice cream and get as many ice cream bars and sunnies as you want. But no matter how rich the rewards, every American soldier has to experience loss. I was over there, I had two milkshakes. One of the Marines goes, you're gonna have both of those, fatty? So I gave him one and then my other one fell. I had to go back and get two more. So tune in as we chronicle the victories and the defeats for American hero, Bob Kelly. I broke my knee, man! On the next American War Stories. Dude, let's go! Come on, behind Bob! <laughs> Bob, Follow me, away. dude! The gays are coming! The gays are coming, dude! I broke my knee, dude! You go where you want. I'm following Bob! Oh, Steve from Bayshore, band of blubbers. Oh, jeez. Dude! I'll pin him down here, you flank him, dude! Apocalypse cow. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's a good one. <laughs> Baboon. <laughs> uh, it is, I'm not even the fattest guest on the show. I'm like the third fattest person that you guys have been. You're not supposed to be fat. Uh, that's right, right. You're absolutely right. Full I'm jacket. <laughs> Eat hamburger on the hill. <laughs> <laughs> the dirty dozen donuts. <laughs> saving leftovers. <laughs> what? I don't know, saving why private Ryan. Uh, it's it's got to kind of sound like it. Yeah, why would exactly. you save the leftovers? I'm just trying to make fun of myself. My mom told me that. Make fun of yourself. That's it takes right. the fun out of it for them. La no, it doesn't. <laughs> no, it doesn't. It adds to it. Apparently, it doesn't. Fuels us. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, oh, General <laughs> Fatten. <laughs> Wow. This is a, wow, this is a good one. This is such a pounding. Ah, woo. <laughs> woo. General Douglas McCorka. <laughs> I don't know. I just went in. They just started going off. I mean, what am I supposed to do? <laughs> I'm just trying to practice my therapy for next Tuesday. I just, they just started going nuts. <laughs> but they were all good ones. <laughs> or, uh, uh, or uh, a, what do you want? A pack of chips now. <laughs> <laughs> ah, wow. <laughs> that was wonderful. Uh, teasing. Tora, oh. Tora, Tora, my pants. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you guys are going way back. <laughs> uh, John, John, from, John from Bayville, flags of our fatties. <laughs> Hoagies Heroes coming in from Brian. <laughs> Hoagies Heroes. <laughs> from Brian in St. Louis. Obi <laughs> was trying to stay out of it, and they started reading. All right, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Good oh, one. Well, the, the fridge over River Kwai. <laughs> <laughs> Dude. Oh, my God. God. If I had IMDB in front of me right now, it would be messy. Oh, man. What, what Casualties of Ward <laughs> Drobe. <laughs> the guns of Provolone. <laughs> Uh, the guns of Provolone. Uh, uh, oh, wow, uh, uh, that is a good one. Uh, you know, Mikhail's gravy. Uh, oh my God, uh, that's a good one. Uh, wow. Sarge, uh, very funny. Wow. Uh, wow. Well, you know, let me tell you something. The troops are gonna hear from me tonight. A bunch of traitors. <laughs> hey, Bobby, what are you wearing, man? I'm late to the party on this. Uh, oh boy, it's, uh, this new gadget you got. It's a. It's called the bandolier. <laughs> this is, a, is something that Bobby joke, has. Right? No. no. 
This is something. Now, you know how Bobby, uh, over the years, has brought things to the show, and we've laughed at them. Yeah, and, like the and, iPad. And later they have. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm not even going to. I'm not going to. Wow, we got to find that audio. Fucking idiots. Yeah, well, you need an iPad for. You I got, got your the phone. phone. You got your. It's between oh, the computer and the audio. Right? You're, you're, every right. Single you're right. One you're right. You're right about you're the right. iPad. I, no, I've been right about everything. I'll no. give you that. Name you're me right. one thing. But. Kick ass the movie. Kick ass the movie. He came with that. Fuck that movie. I understand. Okay. But this bandolier thing <laughs> yeah. that you have is not going to take off, Bobby. It's going to take off. It, yeah. Absolutely. What Bobby has on mm -hmm. him mm -hmm. is what amounts to, let's say you're carrying a bag, like a, 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 a computer bag golf or something. Bag, golf bag, right. Great golf bag. And you have the strap that goes around um, your shoulder and then down <laughs> your back, and, and the bag hangs on your side. Mm -hmm. It's that without the bag. It's just the strap. And on the strap are various pouches and pockets and Velcro things. What is he doing? Where he puts his phone and his wallet and pens and water. Hold on, hold on, Bob. And six, hold on a minute. A and hold on now. But it's just the strap. So it's on him like a bandolier. If you remember, like in the old uh, movies, you'd see uh, guys carrying ammunition in their bandolier. So it's a bandolier. Yeah. This or a girl, a girl, a girl Scout sash. <laughs> so w what's the purpose of the bandolier? Well, okay. You, you, you have a backpack, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. It's fucking cumbersome. Yeah. It's a lot of fucking shit. Sometimes you don't need Isn't all that, that what space. you wear for prom? <laughs> no, that's a that's cummerbund. A cummerbund. <laughs> Why did he say it as Norton, though? He didn't I even know. say it as Chip. He, he's you getting fucked lazy. up, you fucking silly douche. <laughs> no, he really wanted to make it hurt. He didn't yeah. fuck I, up. Um... Yeah, it, uh, yeah, it's a shoulder holster utility pack. You got <laughs> right here. Look, you got your. Right. You can put all your credit cards, some note stuff. This is classic Bobby too, by the right way. Right here, dude. Right. You can put your yeah, credit cards. Boom, card. your then. note stuff. What note stuff? <laughs> you know you should have note stuff. stuff. We you should have Bob about right have, now. You should have. You should have Norton do me with the. I'm thing. describing it. Of course. <laughs> all right. All right. All right. Let's uh, uh, let's get better. this here. Hold on. So Norton's gonna explain the bandolier. He's explaining it here. Doing the Bob Kelly impression. Yeah, you know what, dude? You just got to, boom, you put on your bandolier, dude. Because a lot of times you got these inconvenient... What are these little holes in the pants for? <laughs> like these, oh, pockets. These, oh, pockets, yeah, you do. You put like a piece of paper in there. There's no more room, dude. So you wear this. It's like a Girl Scout thing. Look, dude, boom, you got your water. So you're walking along. Hey, I've gone four feet. I'm thirsty, dude. <laughs> boom, take a sip of water. <laughs> You got your phone right here, like you got to call somebody. Hey, boom, I'm going to be late, dude. I'll be right there. <laughs> boom, look at this. You got right here. You got your iPad. <laughs> boom, dude, you pop that in. You list. Uh, look at these things with cobwebs on them. <laughs> Pens? Yeah. Oh, you're, you're implying he doesn't write. <laughs> oh, is that what they <laughs> I didn't know what these were, dude. I was just stabbing people with them. <laughs> hey, look at this, dude. You just spin it around because it saves you a lot of trouble. This way you don't have to actually go into your, what are these? Oh, pockets. oh, yeah, your pockets, dude. You just put it right here. This way you don't have to notice it. You're slowly killing yourself. All right. Oh, look at this. You turn it the wrong way. Your water turns upside down, dude. It spills right on ruins your phone. So basically, this thing's going to do about $2,000 worth of damage, dude. Boom. Boom. You get anything for your notes. You want to write a note to yourself? Boom. Remember dude. to photograph feet later so you can see them. Boom. Get out, dude. You, dude, got, you your... got your knife and fork just in case the friction <laughs> burnt out the other ones. Yeah, dude. You got your knife. Your fork, you get your straw. Dude, boom, look at this. You can fold up a little tablecloth. Boom, dude. You have a picnic. You sit in the park. Boom, dude. You do your podcast. Boom, dude. You go to Chicago. You put your ID in here. You put your credit cards in there. Boom, you take a note. Dude, boom. You shut up. just take it off on the plane, right? And put it right in the. Uh Right That's what, the, when you travel, it's fucking the best. Boom, dude, you go through security, you take your shoes off, you ask you someone go. to put them up on the belt for you. <laughs> <laughs> you, take, you, you, take this, you take this off, boom, you throw it right on the belt, you save time. Unless you're going for the x-ray picture, and then they got to have three guys push you all the way through it. <laughs> then you lose that time. Dude, one away. It's weeks. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, Give us I, another week. I ate breakfast, I showered. Oh, I, really? I, <laughs> 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 Four, four times before you got here. <laughs> that could be the opening to every story he's ever told. <laughs> Tell us about the murder. Hey, breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit! <laughs> oh shit! Oh fuck! Oh, shit. <laughs>
I uh, I got sick. I went whale watching, and that has to be the worst. Oh, what up, in a mirror? <laughs> <laughs> ah, look at both of you. I've never, I've never seen Jimmy. Jimmy looked like he just got shot. His eyes, his eyes oh, went so wait. wide open. Anthony just came right out. Jimmy went ah, like, he, "Did you just see a ghost, I, dude?" I my, I almost chipped my tooth on the mic leaning in because <laughs> I, I know I figured you think I didn't catch out of my purple this stupid Italian face moving towards the mic. I'm going, I'm going in. We both had the same target. I couldn't get mirror out. It, it was the first thing I thought. Ah, mirror! I knew I had to structure it. It was too. It wasn't structured. It's too good. Uh, uh, Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Both went for that one. Uh, oh, you had it one in a mirror. Boom, beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. Let's go to Cal Hospital. the fire get in uh, the, the day? In 204 uh, degrees. Oh, like you can make muffins. Uh, <laughs> he was setting up for one of our bits, Bobby. Yeah, you ahead. missed it, Bobby, you big fat pig. All right, relax, you <laughs> fucking dumb cunt. I really, I, you come to one of my shows, I'll fucking punch you right in your face. We'll see how fat I am, you fat mustache cunt. <laughs> Bobby's, Bobby is how? finally had how? it. I'm really going to fucking Bobby, punch you right in your <laughs> face, you fat cunt. I hope you die in a fucking magnesium uh, fire today. But it was the way the guy said it like that. <laughs> Please, can we so, hear that again? So, so maybe I should. Read Steven S. from Bayshore's uh, instant feedback, huh? What? Hey, Ope, the crane is out there to lift Bobby's lunch up to the studio. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, actually, yeah. right, Blobby's lunch. That on God, SNL, man. That would be perfect. Yeah. Just make him the White House correspondent. Yeah. <laughs> Just ask him, all ask him a question. Yeah, blithering Bob. <laughs> <laughs> So I love that we have yeah. something new on him now that he is fat. Oh, I know. It's just, now that he's not fat, he can just be a blitter. He's got to find that perfect uh, balance of, of yeah. sort of out of shape and not quite stupid. <laughs> and you got one more? Oh, Dad, the thing is, taxes are going to go up, and they're going to keep throwing in all their own shit. Everybody got to get their own shit in there. Nobody cares about so what's what going on. So what about a every... set flat tax? Yeah, but I... The phone ain't ringing. <laughs> he freezes like the Tin Man when he gets water thrown. <laughs> Hello. No, you're just a mean. <laughs> I don't know. If this show helps me or hurts me. <laughs> Are you listening, Bobby? Reason, I think this show actually helps me not sell tickets. Who would come see a guy that goes, dude, you know, Obama? <laughs> Just a mean person. Well, dude, it's you not about do, you. You don't do it good. Ask him. I don't do me good. No, <laughs> it's not about you on stage. It's just off stage. On stage, you're fine. It's off stage where you should be shot. <laughs> Bob, you think these assholes? Yes, I'm sorry. Go Bob, ahead. show them you're intelligent. Talk about politics. Uh, um, what do you want to know? I just can't randomly throw my intelligence out on the fucking table. Of course not. Who would say it? <laughs> Well, how about, all right, how about something that's in the news? The, what do you got on the swine flu? Well, actually, the swine flu is not uh, that big of a deal, to be honest with you. Uh, most diseases sometimes... How many people uh, have come down with it? Uh, well, 60 have died in Mexico. Nobody's died in America. <laughs> that's yes. no. More than 60 have died. No idea. <laughs> You're trying to sound smart. You're trying too hard. No, no, absolutely. <laughs> more, than si hard. more than 60 have died. Just nobody be quiet, you'll died, hear him clicking, Googling. <laughs> <laughs> no one's died in America now, he says. Yeah, they have in Texas and Dallas. Nobody they've got... In, yeah. Uh, the, the, uh, it's in Vancouver, too. It's, oh. a, it's a affected... Uh, oh, I'm being asked that. How, how, how many people in Mexico have died? I like how he's really trying to keep his voice low right now. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Actually, yeah. yeah. what's yeah. going on here? The swine flu. He'll get mad. Uh, All right, dude. When, when Bob rehearses at home, here's what will happen. He'll hold in a shit while sipping a coffee and smoking a cigarette, and the dogs just fucking feign interest. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Diva and Kelby have to listen to him. You know what, dude? I'm telling you, you're going to go to court. You're going to get all your shit back. There's not going to be any problems. Yeah, but do you think that will be... I don't even... <laughs> <laughs> Uh, 
It's just, yeah, you, you know, it just hurts my feelings. That, dude, you know what the problem is, dude? You're being too smarmy. You're getting all caught up in your smarmy. thing. How am I being smarmy? Because you just, yeah. <laughs> I don't like that you added a new thing to it, you fucking asshole. <laughs> it's brand new and hysterical. It sure is. What is it? <laughs> <laughs> That's how you. Do that. That's how, no, but that's that's you was running out of steam talking. You just stop in mid sentence, like you just freeze with your hands up in the air. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not painting shit. you well, Bob. Uh, I, have, <laughs> I have nothing bad. I have nothing bad to say about you, Jim. As a and as a human being on and off stage, you're just uh, an amazing. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit.